Hi, Dr. Ross. I watched your video on prostate massage, and I do have a question, if that's okay. You mentioned that one of the effects of BPH could be the obstruction of ejaculate. For quite a while, when I masturbate and have an orgasm, I get contractions, say five or six, but no semen comes out until that time. To get it all out, it seems like I have to more or less force it. Is this what you were referring to by the obstruction of ejaculate? Thank you very much, Mike. Mike, you nailed it. That's exactly what I'm talking about. And just to kind of go back to the anatomy on things, I just want to reiterate, okay? So if we're doing an internal prostate massage, this is kind of what this would look like, right? You've got the massager into the rectum and you see where the flashing lights are here, this is actually what it's gonna look like, right? Like if we're, if we have the, the, the vibration on, right? So now what I wanna do is show you where, so that's, that's the back of the prostate that, that that massager is in. So now look at this. This is the back of the prostate. And when we're looking at the posterior aspect of the prostate, you see the prostate gland here, right? Let me see, let me get my um, marker here. So we see the prostate right down here. But look over here, these little structures here. What you are looking at is the seminal vesicle, which is really very much responsible for making the majority of the fluid that comes out the seminal fluid that comes out. I mean, you know, so many processes are involved in this, but this is where the majority of it. Now that seminal vesicle empties into the prostate. So the prostate has those glands or ducts that we talk about that are very necessarily need to be wide open and not congested. They don't need to have any stones in them because if they do, guess what? none of the ejaculate or the semen can make it through. So that is ultimately one of the big reasons why I keep saying that with prostate issues, sometimes you have an obstruction of the duct system and you have an obstruction of the ejaculate system that sometimes just getting behind it or on top of it with a, a prostate massage actually can, can, can free things up a bit, right? Because remember, let's see. Because remember that when we're looking at the anatomy of all of this, like here, this is from Encyclopedia Britannica, by the way. How many of you had the, like the encyclopedias at your house when you were little, right? Like this is from there right? If you, if you zoom in, see these blue arrows? This is really talking about the pathway that sperm takes before it empties itself out, right? Into the um, urethra so that it ends up actually being expelled when you actually ejaculate. Well, follow these blue arrows around, right? And what you're going to find is, let me see, let me put it on, on edit here so that I can actually make some edits that actually when you look at here and you see the prostate, I'm circling the prostate now. Let me zoom in. You see here, you've got these pathways or these ducts here. This pathway, so, so the, this, this part of the Y here, there's two of those on your prostate. So one on each side connecting to the seminal vesicle. If either one of those are clogged up or blocked up because the prostate is enlarged or it's just got a stone stuck there or some old fluid stuck there, then it, then it can't pass through. Because remember, the prostate's job is to, almost like a slingshot, you know, rubbery slingshot, go contract and shoot out. So if, if, um, if, if these ducts are closed, it can do all of that and nothing will shoot out or it'll ooze out or it'll whatever out and it, and it won't do its job. So remember when we're getting behind the prostate to do the massage, you know, like coming this way, or if you're actually doing an external massage and you're going up this way, you are passing the vibrations up through the prostate with the idea of 
kind of massaging it so that we can um, potentially calm some of the inflammation of the prostate and potentially open up some of those ducts. Oh, I made I made a lot of like stuff on here that yeah. So see. Okay, I hope that helps.